Hello trans and welcome back to another video. Today, uh, I am going to be showing you how to install a custom map. So, uh, this right here is Atlantia. Um, it's a pretty good map. I like it a lot. So, first, what you're gonna want to do is go on to whatever your normal web browser is. Sorry, I just had to move a couple papers there. They were in my way. Um... Apparently, I had Agarabi opened up before. Don't use it. It's, uh, it, uh, I, I get a lot of scams on that website. <laughs> uh, well, at least that's for me. I don't know about for you guys, but let's go ahead and go to Terraria. So, open up Terraria.org. Come on. Now, I don't quite remember... How I did this, I think I went to forms. Then from here, I could go. No, that wasn't it. <laughs> oh, crap. I'm asking my friend a question. I'm not yelling. Um, Terraria custom maps on curse. So you go to Curse, and on Curse, there's a bunch of Terraria custom maps right here that you can get. Uh, you can search the Terraria maps. So, for this episode, I think I'm going to go with the Builder's Workshop. So, you click on the map that you want to install. Come on. Sorry, my computer's just... Really slow, as all you dudes and dudettes know. Alright, so you come here, and you want to click this little thing over here. It says download now, and there's a box, kind of like a file cabinet. Click that. And this is for computer, by the way. <laughs> Just letting you guys know. Sorry about that. Uh, start in three, two, one, and downloading now, it should be at least. Come on. Alright, uh, yeah. Yeah, that should work, so save. And then once you do that, it's gonna run the, uh, well, it should. It should run the security. Then you click open folder. Then, I'll show you the easy way. You come to your search, the web and Windows. You want to search Windows. And you want to search Worlds, I think I searched. It was either Worlds or Terraria. Here, I'll search Terraria because I have Minecraft and stuff. Which use Worlds folders, I think. So, Terraria file folder right over here. You want to open that also. Well, whoops, I just clicked a link, and I don't want that opened. Alright, come on, files. So, this is Terraria. This is downloads. of all my downloads over there. Alright, so, uh, Builder 3.03.1. You want to open that, and you should have the .wld folder. Then, oh, where did this guy go? Then you open your Terraria folder and go to Worlds. These are all of my worlds. Builder.wld should go into here just fine. Now, I can't guarantee you dudes and dudettes that this will work. I got Defense Period, um, Defense Pyramid, and that wouldn't work. So, let's try it. Copying one item to worlds. Sorry if this takes a while. Um, I'm gonna close up our Terraria match. Because it does need to refresh, I think, the entire game. Uh, let's see if it does, at least. Exit. Uh, come on, install. Come on, 85%. I'm 
should be coming any time now. <laughs> it doesn't always go very fast for me. Usually doesn't. It actually only has one item remaining, which is zero bites. <sighs> so, yeah. Well, this was actually builder.wld, so I'm gonna close the worlds folder and I'm gonna stop that. I'm gonna cancel it. And then I'm going to see if it's actually in my worlds because my computer is really buggy. Um, yeah, you see, I can't just type in worlds. Terraria. Uh, go down a bit. And worlds. Yeah, so builder.wld is right here. 402 gigabytes, nothing bad. I think it's either gigabytes or kilobytes. I'm not very good with the bytes, but... <laughs> um, so that should be there. Now I'm going to open Terraria right back up and see if it worked. Got my apple cider right here. Tell me, tell me in the comments if you guys get, um, like, it, Terraria takes a while to open when you try to load it. Like, you can see how long it's taking me to load Terraria. So, sorry if it doesn't show, but in the worlds you could see the Atlantia and the WLD, and it showed that that was a world. So, come on, Terraria. You gonna open for me? Got my gaming mouse here. Can do that. Got a Christmas tree yesterday. Nothing on it yet. Because we have to let it fall before we can put anything on it. Why isn't Terraria? Ah, oh, here we go. Can you re-dig it? Don't think I can, but who knows? Apple cider. Not responding. All right, here we go. Single player. Let's hope this works, guys. Uh, let's go on to this account. Is it here? Ah, here we go. Builder's Workshop, guys. Come on. Oh, is it gonna freeze or is it gonna load? It's not responding. Something tells me it might freeze. Said in liquids. Liquids like my apple cider. Will it load? Don't know if you think it's gonna load. If not, oh, you guys were wrong if you thought it wouldn't. I'm sorry, guys. That was mean of me. I'm sorry. Okay, so. Oh, it's still a little glitchy. Alright, where's my mouse? So, this is... Wow. This is the map. And these chests are full of stuff. Life crystals and life fruit. So much platinum. I can actually use all that for my coin gun. That's going to be pretty helpful. So I'll just take all this little bit of it at least. All this platinum. Ooh. I can use that for this guy right here. Got my laser machine gun. That thing is going to be OP now. How much damage does it do now? Platinum does 204. Pretty good, pretty good. Not as good as the Meowmer. But pretty good. We've got our golden keys, temple keys, key of light, key of night, shadow key, frozen keys, crimson keys, all the keys. Uh, we've got glow sticks. All of these are named. We got 1.3 materials in here. 
potion ingredients gel, miscellaneous, miscellaneous materials, PvP gems, treasure. You guys, there's everything you could ever want on here, and it's a private server. So, no one can take any of it. Down there, I think you've got every wall in the game. I'm not very positive of that, but... Up here, we've got armor and every suit. And we have chests over them. Here I am, guys. My beautiful creeper suit. We've got all of this. Everything any of you guys could ever want. You know how you're always on that server and... Everyone's just taking everything. You can never get anything. Well, fear no more, guys. It's not infinite, but I'm sure you could just delete the file and re, you know, get the file. So, yeah, guys, that is how you get a custom map. I actually do highly recommend this map. Pretty nice, all the infinite stuff that you could ever watch, but, uh,. Yeah, guys, that's really all for this episode. If you enjoyed, please leave a like or punch that subscribe button in the face so hard that you break its nose. But, uh, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Bye!